Hello and welcome, Dave and Joan Maroney, your Mother Mercy messengers here with you. And this is another Divine Mercy. <laughs> As I click the button, uh, where was I? Button. Another Divine Mercy. Another Divine Mercy. Adoration for our nations. Holy Hour Novena. Amen. Praying here during Easter week, uh, leading us up to just a few short days away to the Feast of Mercy. And we're very blessed today to have joining us a very special guest, Victoria Weber, um, that called in one day with, with some questions. I'm going to let her share that story. And the more we got speaking, and she's so on fire for divine mercy. Today is the seventh day of the novena, where we pray for um, the souls who especially venerate and glorify my mercy. And the more Victoria shared, I thought she is, she's a perfect person for this. And all of you that are here right now, all of you that are imploring God's mercy, Amen. doing whatever you can to help people uh, live their, the message, learn the message, all your works of mercy, all of you oh, are doing that. So we rejoice in that today. And Dave, what are you doing? I'm sharing the screen. And before, <laughs> before we turn it over, I wanted to just play a little bit of clip. This well, is this just... will be our opening prayer. Why don't we do that? Yes. This is great. This, All right. Yes. Oh, you're this, very sweet. Thank you. Victoria and... That's our lady. And amen. Wow. Blessed mother can do it all. Wow. That's can she not? Can she not do it all? She can do it all. 
And praise be to God. Praise, praise be to God. Amen. Victoria, we're just going to turn it over to you and pick it up from there, girl. <laughs> While we try to recollect ourselves here. <laughs> Uh, it's so wonderful to be with you today, this afternoon. Um, I cannot tell you the joy that it brings me to see so many beautiful faces on the screens, beautiful names. I've been walking on this journey with you every day since Good Friday, and it has been my honor to do it and it's such a privilege to be here at Jones Invitation. You know, uh, my church is based out in Hoboken, New Jersey. So, uh, St. Francis, the little church with a big heart. And, and it just so happens that we are having our women's retreat, our third annual women's retreat this Saturday. And of course, we did it on purpose, Divine Mercy Weekend. We said, what better weekend than Divine Mercy Weekend? The uh, theme is finding the gift of God forgiveness and healing through divine mercy. Um, it's a big deal in my church. I called because I wanted to include the diary as a gift to each and every single lady who was coming to participate in this Saturday's women's retreat. Um, I said, I'm also a, a member of the Association of the Miraculous Medal. And you know what they say, the more miraculous medals you pass out, the more our ladies' voices heard. And the same thing goes with Divine Mercy Chaplet. But the more you can share its message, the more it gets out there to the world, the closer you bring hearts to Christ. Um, so when I called Divine Mercy of America's offices, and Joan picked up the phone. I thought, wow, she sounds so lovely on the voice. Maybe on the phone, maybe she can help me. So I'm looking for the book. I needed at least 60. And I told her the story of what was happening. And she just came to my aid. And then another conversation started happening. And she's, you know, the question came up, oh, so, you know, what do you do at your church? And I told her I'm a member of the young adult uh, ministry at church. I'm a cantor at my church and uh, an, another church nearby. And um, and it, it just started the conversation rolling. And she said, oh, you, and I said, but I haven't always been Catholic. I went through the RCIA program in 2012 at my church. And I've just been literally on fire ever, ever since that. Um, and when she asked me, well, what brought you to the decision to become Catholic? And I said, truthfully, it was, it was blessed mother. I know that I had gotten this calling to get closer to Christ when I was in university, um, studying for my master's degree and it's one of those things where the pull to do more with your faith and through your faith gets louder and louder. I don't know if I'm talking to the right crowd here, but I think I am. And I started going on my own little pilgrimage, <laughs> finding convents, trying to talk to people in religious orders, trying to figure out what this all meant and they said you really need to find a very good church that's going to be welcoming you as as someone that's new to the faith that's most important um and i got some recommendations and you know saint francis was top of the list so welcoming from the moment i walked in and and i, I shared with joan as soon as you walk into the church, the first thing you see, divine mercy pain. First thing. And that was not by accident. That was purposefully done by our beloved former pastor, uh, Father Michael Guglielmelli. Um, He passed away in 2017, but he had 
a devotion to Divine Mercy Chaplet anytime you saw him. He kept the diary in his pocket. He'd pull it out and start and start quoting from it. It was it was unbelievable. And uh that's that's how I first became introduced to it. It was through him. And uh he said when I told him about what I wanted to, you know, how I had been feeling this pull and you know, and then the balancing act as a performer, there's so much in this world um, that is not of Christ that pulls you in so many different directions. Um, but I have to, I feel like I'm not home anywhere else but here. I remember telling my mom as I would go to go to mass, I, I said, I'm going to be late. I have to go to my father's house. She says, I get it. Go, go. But, um, you know, so I've made certain choices in my life. You know, I'm okay with not having the uh, bombastic career anymore that that is pushed upon you when you're trying to make this a professional career. And that's something that I've imparted to a lot of young people that I've spoken with. I said, there is plenty in this world that will try and break your heart. Jesus will not. Jesus restores. Jesus only asks that you open the door of your heart to let him in. That's it. And if you would be ardent in that action, then whatever it is that you need to hap happen, he'll take care of the rest. Wherever you feel that you're going to fall short, oh, Victoria, but you know, I'm 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 not this or I'm not that. I haven't done that. I don't know as much as these people. That's okay. That's okay. If you just start by praying, maybe just a prayer. The first building block to any relationship is showing up. Show up to prayer. Wake up in the morning. Be grateful that you woke up. Now, be a friend to somebody else. Pay it forward. Once you've, once you've built that relationship with Christ, now pay it forward. Bring someone else with you. And I'm telling you, it's it's proven fruitful for our young adult group. Um, anybody can tell you who lives in this area, this NYC metro area, um, I'm literally five minutes outside of the Lincoln Tunnel uh, to get into Midtown Manhattan in New York City. So Hoboken is just as close. Um, it's a very transient area. So a lot of young people who come into town straight out of college, looking to live as close to the city as they can, but keep it somewhat affordable. Um, and then all of a sudden they come in single and they walk out married and then they move away. So that all happens sometimes within the time span of maybe three to five years. And with that, what you want to sort of build is, or what the churches in my in, in town typically try for is, if you're going to settle here and build roots here, we have a place for you. We welcome you. We welcome you as a single person. We welcome you as a young single person. We welcome you as a married couple and your families. And that sense of community doesn't go away. It just grows and grows. So we have lots to offer. I wish I wish all of the churches would be as active when it comes to Divine Mercy Weekend. It hurts my heart to, to think that there are communities that don't even know about Divine Mercy. Um, so I'm so happy and honored to be here to help spread the word. I know I've told everybody at my parish and they're going to be turned on to divine mercy of America. Uh, 
sure enough, by this weekend, if they haven't heard it, if they haven't tuned in, they will this weekend. So I'm, I'm so honored to be here. Thank you. Thank you for the chance to pray with you and to build community with you. Oh, you're welcome. Oh, you're welcome. Beautiful. It, it's brought awesome. me to tears, Victoria. Oh, Victoria, how many how many are in your young adult group, and what what is the age span? Oh goodness, right now we're about up to twenty four. Um, and the age range is anywhere from twenty two to forty eight. Okay. It's a little over the top, and we're also thinking that typically it would be 35, but what we're finding is, is that there's nothing for the age range of 35 and above. So what do you do? So we're lucky enough to have a resident, a pastor in residence who is the, uh, who is our counselor, our advisor. And he says, no one, we will never close the door on anybody because they're not in an age range. That's that's just not gonna happen here. So all are welcome <laughs> at any age. Um, and the other great thing uh, that I'd love to see if, if somebody wants to write it in the chat too, I'm very interested in seeing how many people know about adoration, because I have found in our young adult group, that is a big deal. Um, and we have found just here that n not many churches do it. And that's also been a main attraction a lot we we've, we've garnered membership because we offer adoration just for our young adult group our young adult members so when we meet twice a month every other monday and it's typically the first monday and that first meeting of the month that's when adoration is and we will open with adoration and we offer the church offers reconciliation as part of that adoration period so that's been huge for us. You know, it's so simple. And, and just reminding me that um, that's what the rays of mercy's re mercy represents, you know, adoration, the Eucharist and, and reconciliation. And those who live in the shadow of these rays, and now I'm going to get my quote wrong, but basically the Lord says, you know, you're protected, you're covered. And we don't need yes. programs. We don't need to be doing all kinds of crazy things, you know, it's just very, the basics. And if you start with that and how beautiful for young people, when the challenges are so tough and like you're saying, you know, they're, they're building careers, they're dating, they're, they've got relationship issues. They're maybe away from home for the first time. Um, it's. And finding those like-minded souls, right? Finding that people to your point, even our talks, um, when we have speakers come in or when we when we are picking topics, I cannot tell you the hottest topics that are that are discussed are dating, building relationship, building a future, but making that home a Catholic home. Um, and and when you're when you're dealing with maybe the fact that somebody is curious who is not of the Catholic faith, but they want to get on that journey because they love you, then it's learning how to introduce them to the faith in the right way and, and keeping that reverence intact and learning about the Eucharist and, and all that that means. We believe that is Jesus Christ. It is not a symbol to us. It is our Lord and Savior. It's the Eucharist. And uh, we have found through, through more catechism, more intense study in our groups, more prayer. We've, our group is, is very strong, very strong about that and about sharing that message. Praise God. That's a, it's a, a ray of hope <laughs> for, 
be hopeful be hopeful yes i i that was part of part of my joy in being here today with all of you and especially in because of the veneration aspect of today of today's session be hopeful be joyous young people we want the traditions we want the lord in our life full time not part time we believe that he is with us and we want to walk together and we are not despondent we are not we are not discards we want to be a part of god's community and we are doing all that we can to restore that we really really are little things all it takes is little things whether it's a mentorship whether it's the young adult whether it's helping out with ccd helping out as an usher at church at any given mass little things it all adds up bringing you closer bringing somebody else closer to christ well, so well said and uh, such a joy to have you here today. And I think with that, it's the perfect lead in to uh, going to visit our Lord. What are you? I just want to show uh, the map. Uh, it's okay. taking a bit to, to load in. Hoboken. Hometown. You see how close we are to the water? <laughs> wow. Hometown of Frank Sinatra, <laughs> right? Yes. That was his church. Oh, my goodness. Yes, yes. We are, that is, that is one of the calling cards. It's where he was baptized. <laughs> We've been in Hoboken. I don't remember the name of the parish. I meant to look that up. I don't think it was St. Francis. Oh, that's right. You mentioned that. Maybe it's St. Anne's. St. Anne's is a very large church too. Uh, maybe but we're tiny compared to them. <laughs> we were. Uh, tiny and mighty. Right across Manhattan. Yep. You are in the heart of it. We were, yes, okay, good. All right. Yep. All right. Now we know where you are. And now we yes. have people from New Jersey on with us today. <laughs> yes, we I saw that. I was I was seeing some of the uh, the the names and then it would say New Jersey. And I was like, oh, maybe they're by me. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, let's go to Vilnius. Let's do that. We're going to travel over to the place where the original painting of the Divine Mercy was commissioned and uh, stored and is now on display there in the Perpetual Adoration Chapel where our Lord is always there, ready. You can visit this chapel anytime. It's just after midnight over there, I believe. And uh, I just love uh, popping in there. And I love when I see the people there tending to things, tending to flowers, tending to the candles. And I think it's midnight. These people are in the church taking care of things, making visits. It's really beautiful. And they've had music going on the other day. I was saying that I could hear music and it wasn't uh, transmitting across Zoom, but uh, they've been having music in it since the we're showing it in a PowerPoint. It... Uh, Maybe it's the novena or something. It could be the or novena. Or... Oh. Yes. Maybe that's what that was. I wish I could share it a little bit. You know, it's in Lithuanian, but it's it's in it's interesting. But I'd maybe I can figure out how to how to share it across the Zoom. Here's our friend Lauren. All right, and here's the Lord. Okay, so we savo spare Lauren. our hearts. Savo, savo naryste, savo mintimis, savo darbais. Can you hear that? Yes. Beautiful. Vaitskūnas, Elvis Vaitskūnas, kuris šiuo metu kunigauja Vilniuje, švenčiausios mergelės nekalto prasidėjimų. Wow, that is something. I didn't do anything to 
to transfer the audio over. Holy Spirit. Yes. All right. Well, let's start off with our spiritual communion prayer. Amen. In the name of the Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit. My Jesus, I believe that you are present in the most blessed sacrament. I love you above all things, and I desire to receive you into my soul. Since I cannot now receive you sacramentally, come at least spiritually into my heart. I embrace you as if you were already there, and I unite myself wholly to you. Never permit me to be separated from you. Amen. And now we begin the Most Holy Rosary of the Blessed Virgin Mary. The Immaculate Virgin, Mother of God, in the name of the Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. I believe in God, the Father Almighty, creator of heaven and earth, and in Jesus Christ, his only Son, our Lord, who was conceived by the Holy Spirit, born of the Virgin Mary, suffered under Pontius Pilate, was crucified, died, and was buried. He descended into hell. On the third day, he rose again from the dead. He ascended into heaven and is seated at the right hand of God the Father Almighty. From there, he will come to judge the living and the dead. I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Holy Catholic Church, the communion of saints and the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body and life everlasting. Amen. Amen. And for our Holy Father, our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. For an increase in faith, hope, and charity, hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women. And blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is, is now, now, and, and ever shall be, world, world without, without end. end. Amen. Okay. The first glorious mystery, the resurrection. The angel said to the women, do not be afraid, for I know that you are looking for Jesus who has been crucified. He is not here, for he has risen, just as he said. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in us now, and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in us now, and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, Pray for our sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst 
woman, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for our sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for our sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O oh, my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of thy mercy. The second glorious mystery, the Ascension. <clears throat> Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, <laughs> pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. 
Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Ghost. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be world without end. Amen. O oh my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of thy mercy. Um, help me out. Help me out with the last prayer, please. No, you're good. No, I'm good. I'm good. Okay. Good. You're good. Okay. Okay, Victoria, we go ahead and lead the third decade, please. Sure. Raymond's responding. Okay. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive, and us, forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us, and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, Pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O oh, my Jesus, forgive us our sins. Save us from the fires of hell. I lead all souls into heaven, especially those in most need of thy mercy. The fourth decade, the assumption of Mary, body and soul, into heaven. 
Okay, Victoria, you're leading all the decades, so you can. Oh, I am. Okay, <laughs> wonderful. <laughs> For behold, from this time on, all generations will count me blessed, for the Mighty One has done great things for me, and holy is his name. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this give day us our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O oh my Jesus, forgive, forgive us it. our sins. Go ahead. Save us from the fires of hell. Lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of thy mercy. The fifth glorious mystery, the coronation of our blessed mother Mary. A great sign appeared in heaven, a woman clothed with the sun and the moon under her feet and on her head a crown of 12 stars. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Now and at the hour of our death, amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death, amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death, amen. 
Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, as now and ever shall be, world without end. Oh, my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of thy mercy. Hail, Holy Queen, Mother of mercy, our life, our, our, sweetness, life, our sweetness, and our hope. To thee do we cry, poor banished children of Eve. To thee do we send up our sighs, mourning and weeping in this valley of tears. Turn then, most gracious Abbot, thine eyes of mercy towards us, and after this our exile, show unto us the blessed fruit of thy womb, Jesus. O clement, O loving, O sweet Virgin Mary, pray for us, O Holy Mother of God, that we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. And let us pray, O oh God, whose, whose only, only begotten Son, by his life, death, and resurrection, has purchased for us the rewards of eternal salvation. Grant, we beseech thee, that by meditating upon these mysteries of the most holy rosary of the Blessed Virgin Mary, we may imitate what they contain and obtain what they promise through the same Christ our Lord. Amen. And for the intentions of our Holy Father, our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Saint Michael the Archangel, defend, defend us, us in battle. battle. Be our protection against the wickedness and the snares of the devil. May God rebuke him, we humbly pray. And do thou, O Prince of the heavenly host, by the power of God, cast into hell Satan and all who prowl about the world, seeking the ruin of souls. Amen. Sacred Heart of Jesus, have mercy on us. Immaculate Heart of pray Mary, for us. Saint Faustina, pray for us. And Saint Joseph, pray for us. For us, the prayer to Saint Joseph. For you, O oh Blessed Joseph, do we come in our tribulation, 
and having implored the help of your most holy spouse, we confidently invoke your patronage also. Through that charity which bound you to the Immaculate Virgin Mother of God, and through the paternal love with which you embrace the child Jesus, we humbly beg you graciously to regard the inheritance which Jesus Christ has purchased by his blood, and with your power and strength to aid us in our necessities. O most watchful guardian of the Holy Family, defend the chosen children of Jesus Christ. O most loving Father, ward off from us every contagion of error and corrupting influence. O our most mighty protector, be kind to us, and from heaven assist us in our struggle with the power of darkness. As once you rescued the child Jesus from deadly peril, so now protect God's holy church from the snares of the enemy and from all adversity. Shield to each one of us by your constant protection, so that, supported by your example and your aid, we may be able to live piously, to die in holiness, and to obtain eternal happiness in heaven. Amen. Amen. Thanks, Terry. The Whitney of the Saints. Lord, have mercy on us. Lord, have mercy on us. Christ, have mercy on us. Christ, have mercy on us. Lord, have mercy on us. Lord, have mercy on us. Christ, hear us. Christ, graciously hear us. God, the Father of heaven, have mercy on us. God, the Son, Redeemer of the world, have mercy on us. God, the Holy Spirit, have mercy on us. Holy Trinity, one God, have mercy on us. Holy Mary, pray for us. Holy Mother of God, Pray for us. Holy Virgin of Virgins. Pray for us. Saint Michael. Pray for us. Saint Gabriel. Pray for us. Saint Raphael. Pray for us. All you holy angels and archangels. Pray for us. Saint John the Baptist. Pray for us. Saint Joseph. Pray for us. All you holy patriarchs and prophets. Pray for us. St. Peter. Pray for us. St. Paul. Pray for us. St. Andrew. Pray for us. St. James. Pray for us. St. John. Pray for us. St. Thomas. Pray for us. St. James. Pray for us. St. Philip. Pray for us. St. Bartholomew. Pray for us. Saint Matthew. Pray for us. Saint Simon. Pray for us. Saint Jude. Pray for us. Saint Matthias. Pray for us. Saint Barnabas. Pray for us. Saint Luke. Pray for us. Saint Mark. Pray for us. All you holy apostles and evangelists. Pray for us. All you holy disciples of the Lord. Pray for us. All you holy innocents. Pray for us. Saint Stephen. Pray for us. Saint Lawrence. Pray for us. Saint Vincent. Pray for us. Saints Fabian and Sebastian. Pray for us. Saints John and Paul. Pray for us. Saints Cosmo and Damien. Pray for us, all you holy martyrs. Pray for us, Saint Sylvester. Pray for us, Saint Gregory. Pray for us, Saint Ambrose. Pray for us, Saint Augustine. Pray for us, Saint Jerome. Saint Augustine, I'm sorry. Pray for us, Saint Jerome. Pray for us. Saint Martin, pray for us. Saint Nicholas, 
Pray for us. All you holy bishops and confessors. Pray for us. All you holy doctors. Pray for us. Saint Anthony. Pray for us. Saint Benedict. Pray for us. Saint Bernard. Pray for us. Saint Dominic. Pray for us. Saint Francis. Pray for us. Saint Pio. Pray for us. All you holy priests and Levites. Pray for us. All you holy monks and hermits. Pray for us. Saint Mary Magdalene. Pray for us. Saint Agatha. Pray for us. Saint Lucy. Pray for us. Saint Agnes. Pray for us. Saint Cecilia. Pray for us. Saint Anastasia. Pray for us. Saint Catherine. Pray for us. Saint Claire. Pray for us. Saint Elizabeth. Pray for us. Saint Faustina. Pray for us. All you holy virgins and widows. Pray for us. All you holy saints of God. Pray for us. Lord, be merciful. Lord, save your people. From all evil. Lord, save your people. From all sin. Lord, save your people. From your wrath. Lord, save your people. From a sudden and unprovided death. Lord, save your people. From the snares of the devil. Lord, save your people. From anger, hatred, and all ill will. Lord, save your people. From the spirit of uncleanness. Lord, save your people. From lightning and tempest. Lord, save your people. From the scourge of earthquake. Lord, save your people. From plague, famine, and war. Lord, save your people. From everlasting death. Lord, save your people. By the mystery of your holy incarnation. Lord, save your people. By your coming. Lord, save your people. By your birth. Lord, save your people. By your baptism and holy fasting. Lord, save your people. By your cross and passion. Lord, save your people. By your death and burial. Lord, save your people. By your holy resurrection. Lord, save your people. By your wonderful ascension. Lord, save your people. By the coming of the Holy Spirit. Lord, save your people. On the day of judgment. Lord, save your people. Be merciful to us sinners. Lord, hear our prayer. That you will spare us. Lord, hear our prayer. That you will pardon us. Lord, hear our prayer. That it may please you to bring us to true penance. Lord, hear our prayer. Guide and protect your holy church. Lord, hear our prayer. Preserve in holy religion the Pope and all those in holy orders. Lord, hear our prayer. Humble the enemies of holy church. Lord, hear our prayer. Give peace and unity to the whole Christian people. Lord, hear our prayer. Bring back to the unity of the church all those who are straying, and bring all unbelievers to the light of the gospel. Lord, hear our prayer. Strengthen and preserve us in your holy service. Lord, hear our prayer. Raise our minds to desire the things of heaven. Lord, hear our prayer. Reward all our benefactors with eternal blessings. Lord, hear our prayer. Deliver our souls from eternal damnation and the souls of our brethren, relatives, and benefactors. Lord, hear our prayer. Give and preserve the fruits of the earth. Lord, hear our prayer. Grant eternal rest to all the faithful departed. Lord, hear our prayer. That it may please that it may please you to hear and heed us, Jesus, Son of the living God. Lord, hear our prayer. Lamb of God, who takes away the sins of the world. Bear us, O Lord. Lamb of God, who takes away the sins of the world. Graciously hear us, O Lord. Lamb of God, who takes away the sins of the world. Have mercy on us. Christ, hear us. Christ, graciously hear us. Lord Jesus, hear our prayer. Lord Jesus, hear our prayer. Lord, have mercy on us. Lord, have mercy on us. Christ, have mercy on us. Christ, Christ. have mercy on us. Lord, have mercy on us. Lord, have mercy on us. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. 
prayer of St. Gertrude the Great. Eternal Father, I offer thee the most precious blood of thy divine Son, Jesus, in union with the Mass that said throughout the world today, for all the holy souls in purgatory, for sinners everywhere, for sinners in the universal church, those in my own home and within my own family. Amen. 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 I know most of you uh, probably know, but just in case you don't, the Lord promises that when we say that prayer, 1,000 souls are released from purgatory into heaven. It's a great work of mercy. And uh, tomorrow, uh, that's our, our intention, will be for the holy souls in purgatory. So pray for them often. Okay, so I will read the first part from Jesus of the seventh day of the Novena to the Divine Mercy. For today. For today, and then who will do, is it? Eloise. Oh, okay, Eloise. Eloise. Yeah, Helen, I don't think is here today. I didn't see her. I just okay. looked again. And then Donna. DeLuca. DeLuca will do the opening prayers. And then first decade is Chris. Second decade is Mira. Third decade is Eileen. Fourth decade is Cheryl. And fifth decade is... Donna Palucci. Donna Palucci. So, in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, amen. <clears throat> Dear Jesus, we pray this powerful novena that you dictated to St. Faustina to bring the different types of souls to you on each day. So, this seventh day of the Novena to the Divine Mercy. Quoting Jesus, Today, bring to me the souls who especially venerate and glorify my mercy, and immerse them in my mercy. These souls sorrowed most over my passion and entered most deeply into my spirit. They are living images of my compassionate heart. These souls will shine with a special brightness in the next life. Not one of them will go into the fire of hell. I shall particularly defend each one of them at the hour of death. Seventh day, today bring to me the souls who especially venerate and glorify my mercy and immerse them in my mercy. Most merciful Jesus, whose heart is love itself, receive into the abode of your most compassionate heart the souls of those who particularly extol and venerate the greatness of your mercy. These souls are mighty with the very power of God himself. In the midst of all afflictions and adversities, they go forward, confident of your mercy, and united to you, O oh Jesus, they carry all mankind on their shoulders. These souls will not be judged severely, but your mercy will embrace them as they depart from this life. External, oh, sorry, eternal Father, turn your merciful gaze upon the souls who glorify and venerate your greatest attribute, that of your fathomless mercy and who are enclosed in the most compassionate heart of Jesus. These souls are a living gospel. Their hands are full of deeds of mercy and their hearts overflowing with joy. Sing a canticle of mercy to you, O Most High. I beg you, O God, show them your mercy according to the hope and trust they have placed in you. Let there be accomplished in them the promise of Jesus who said to them that during their life, but especially at the hour of death, the souls who will venerate this fathomless mercy of his, he himself will defend as his glory. Amen. And Donna, before we uh, get into the chaplet, I'll read from uh, the brochures, the Marian Fathers, uh, so the intention of those uh, souls who especially venerate and glorify my mercy. The commentary is, 
this text leads one to conclude that in the very first prayer, the one that starts with most merciful Jesus, directed to Jesus, who is the Redeemer, it is the victim souls and contemplatives that are being prayed for. Those persons, that is, that voluntarily offer themselves to God for the salvation of their neighbor. This explains their close union with the Savior and the extraordinary efficacy that their invisible activity has for other. In the second prayer, the second uh, paragraph that Eloise uh, read that starts with the Eternal Father, uh, is directed to the Father from whom comes every worthwhile gift and every genuine benefit. We recommend the, quote, active souls who promote devotion to the divine mercy and exercise with it all the other works that lend themselves to the spiritual and material uplifting of their brethren. Amen and praise God. Okay, Donna. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, amen. You expire, Jesus, but the source of life rushed forth for souls, and the ocean of mercy opened up for the whole world. O fount of life, unfathomable divine mercy, envelop the whole world and empty yourself out upon us. O blood and water, which gushed forth from the heart of Jesus, as a fount of mercy for us, I trust in you. O blood and water, which gushed forth from the heart of Jesus as a fount of mercy for us, I trust in you. O blood and water, which gushed forth from the heart of Jesus as a fount of mercy for us, I trust in you. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. I believe in God, the Father Almighty, creator of heaven and earth, and in Jesus Christ, his only Son, our Lord, who was conceived by the Holy Spirit, born of the Virgin Mary, suffered under Pontius Pilate, was crucified, died, and was buried. He descended into hell. On the third day, he rose again from the dead. He ascended into heaven and is seated at the right hand of God, the Father Almighty. From there, he will come to judge the living and the dead. I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Holy Catholic Church, the communion of saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body, and life everlasting. Amen. Eternal Father, I offer you the body and blood, but soul and divinity, and divinity of your dearly beloved Son, our Lord Jesus Christ. In atonement for our sins and those of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us in the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us in the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us in the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us in the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us in the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us in the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us in the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us in the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us in the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us in the whole world. Eternal Father. I offer you the body and blood, soul and divinity of your dearly beloved Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, in atonement for our sins and those of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. 
for the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. Eternal Father, I offer you the body and blood, soul and divinity of your dearly beloved Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, in atonement for our sins and those of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. Eternal Father, I offer you the body of blood, soul, and divinity of your dearly beloved Son, our Lord Jesus Christ in atonement for our sins and those of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. Donna Pellucci, are you there? Sorry, I forgot to unmute. <laughs> okay. Eternal Father, I offer you the body and blood soul and divinity of your dearly beloved son our lord jesus christ in atonement for our sins and those of the whole world for the sake of his sorrowful passion have mercy on us and on the whole world for the sake of his sorrowful passion have mercy on us and on the whole world for the sake of his sorrowful passion have mercy on us and on the whole world for the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, 
have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on have mercy us and on, on the whole the world. world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, passion. have mercy have on us and on, on the whole world. world. Holy God, oh God, holy, holy mighty, mighty one, one, holy immortal one, have mercy on us and on, and on the, the whole, whole world. Holy God, holy, holy mighty one, holy immortal one, have mercy on us and on the whole world. Holy God, holy mighty one, holy immortal one, have mercy on us and on the whole world. Eternal God, in whom mercy is endless, and, and the, the treasury, treasury of compassion, compassion inexhaustible, look kindly upon us, and increase your mercy in us, that in difficult moments we might not despair, nor become despondent, but with great confidence submit ourselves to your holy will, which is love, and mercy itself. Amen. Jesus, I trust in you. Jesus, I trust in you. Jesus, I trust in you. Love you, Lord, Jesus. And so now we have our prayer to Our Lady, Our Lady of America, dictated to Sister Mary Ephraim. And uh, Victoria is going to read it for us today. Victoria will be putting it on the screen. Can you see it? Oh, Immaculate Mother, Queen of our country, open our hearts, our homes, and our land to the coming of Jesus, your divine Son. With him, reign over us, O Heavenly Lady, so pure and so bright with the radiance of God's light shining in and about you. Be our leader against the powers of evil set upon resting the world of souls redeemed at such a great cost by the sufferings of your son and of yourself. In union with him, from that same Savior who loves us with infinite charity, we gather about you, O chaste and holy mother, virgin and immaculate, patroness of our beloved land, determined to fight under your banner of holy purity against the wickedness that would make all the world an abyss of evil without God, and without your loving maternal care. We consecrate our hearts, our homes, our land, to your most pure heart, O great Queen, that the kingdom of your Son, our Redeemer, and our God may be firmly established in us. We ask no special sign of you, sweet Mother, for we believe in your great love for us, and we place in you our entire confidence. We promise to honor you by faith, love, and the purity of our lives according to your desire. Reign over us then, O Virgin Immaculate, with your Son, Jesus Christ. May his divine heart and your most chaste heart be ever enthroned and glorified among us. Use us, your children of America, as your instruments in bringing peace among men and nations. Work your miracles of grace in us so that we may be a glory to the blessed Trinity who created, redeemed, and sanctifies us. May your valiant spouse, Saint Joseph, with the holy angels and saints, assist you and us in renewing the face of the earth. Then when our work is over, come Holy Immaculate Mother, and as our victorious queen, lead us to the eternal kingdom where your son reigns forever as king. Amen. Amen. Thank you, Victoria. Tantum ergo sacramentum. Venere mur cernui, in 
Jesus, praise you, Jesus, King of heaven, King of earth. Amen, amen. Wow. Awesome. That was powerful. Thank you all for being here and joining us, whether you're live or later, that you're watching the recording. All these prayers make a difference. Every little thing we do out of love for the Lord and souls and has great benefit and gives him honor and glory. And we want to thank our guest speaker today, Victoria Weffer. Am I saying that right, Victoria, your last name? Is it yep. Yep. Victoria, so we're going to turn it over to um, our uh, prayer team here in a minute, but we'll give you an opportunity for any last uh, comments, remarks, anything. I jotted down the names in the chat that were coming through and I'm putting them in prayer for this weekend at my church. So know that it's, <laughs> I was jotting down at the same time. I was doing double duty, trying to get all the names down. So we thank you for this opportunity again to pray with you all. We appreciate that and know that we'll be praying. How many women will be on your uh, retreat this weekend? Right now, I believe we're up to 60 at last count. So our max, as many as we can fit in the room is about 64 squeezing. So we're almost there. Oh, I wish I could be there. <laughs> I would say I do too, but that's being a women's thing. We have a men's retreat, but that happened in, that happened Palm Sunday weekend. Oh, wow. And Palm Saturday, yep. That's beautiful. That's yeah, great. Yeah, incredible. And um, your parish again is? St. Francis in Hoboken. St. Francis. St. Francis of Assisi Church of Hoboken. Yep. Very welcoming parish. And you also, you so you do music ministry there, but also at Our Lady of Chesterhova. Our Lady of Chestahova in downtown Jersey City. So special shouts out to Pastor uh Father Chris Panlilio at St. Francis of Hoboken and Father Brian Page at Our Lady of Chestahova. Thriving churches. On fire. That's great. Yes. Okay, well, we're going to turn it over to, uh, let's share screen with the um, the audience. So if anybody has any questions, and it's while Dave's doing that, you know, it, we're reading the fine print on this little pamphlet and so beautiful because we do have so many I will say suffering souls and victim souls that join us regularly that we are praying for. And, and that is a big part of today's intention um, because they give honor that by venerating, by offering up this suffering. And he said that they um, were so beautiful. Um, These souls are mighty with the very power of God in the midst of their inflict afflictions and adversities. They go forward. You know, accepting all that God has to, has to give us, and and that is so so powerful. So, we we unite we all the unite all so Jesus said they carry they mankind can. on their shoulders. So it's a beautiful reflection. I'm usually thinking that this is you know those of us that are spreading divine mercy, and that what is that is the second part of of Saint Faustina's intention. But really, how uh, the Lord gives honor, and we give Him honor when we offer Him up our our sufferings and 
all of our afflictions. So with that, I will turn it over to, to any of you dear friends. Anybody have a question, a comment? Everybody's kind of quiet and shy. Okay, Evan, I knew you would. I love I, I love her singing voice. Oh. <laughs> what a gift from God. Thank you, Evan. It was my honor to, there was so much pressure, Evan, because you're so good. <laughs> you were the first to with me. Oh, thank wow. you. And I, I, I am so honored to be, to actually, to pray with you and seeing you. Oh, so uh, actually, uh, actually, um, I was in high school and I was in um in choir. Awesome, the best. So was yeah. I. <laughs> wow, absolutely. And actually, I am, I am, I am, I am a tenor. I can hear that in your speaking voice too. Thank you. Yeah. So yeah, I, I used to sing this. Since middle school through high school. Wonderful, wonderful. In, in the church. Awesome, Evan. He's a great uh he's a great Catholic. He's a great prayer warrior. Mm -hmm. And a Marian helper. And a Marian helper. We are blessed to have him as part of as our a prayer warrior team. That's what we call everybody. Thanks, mm -hmm. Evan. Thanks for sharing that. I'm glad yes, you're welcome. I think everybody enjoyed Victoria. You can go to her website. It's uh, Victoria Weffer, W E F E R, right? Dot com. Yeah. And yep. there are some of her performances there. Victoria, I love uh, not just your voice, but your theatrics. You, you know, your. I would <laughs> love to come to one of your performances. I will. Oh, I will. I will definitely send you the emails anytime they're out. We'll, you know, and I have to say that was one of the things that in our archdiocese, you know, throughout the pandemic, when there were so many closures, the church really came through with being the first to open its doors. Really? Yeah. Yeah. Awesome. Wow. You know, our, our priests were very strong about that. Thanks be to God. Because boy, oh boy, did our people need it. Our people still need that so much, so much. Well, it's been great. This is uh, how we've been able to meet. When we were with Mary Kay yesterday, got to meet meet her and give each other a hug. And it was so great to meet in person. But we, she said, you know, the silver lining from the pandemic was the fact that we've been able to meet and build friendships yes. with people. And this has been wonderful, but it, there is something special about being there in person, um, you know, one-on-one -on -one and being in the church together and and praying together. Mary Kay, what'd you think about last night, yesterday? Oh, it was amazing. Um, it was amazing for several reasons because number one, meeting you and Dave in person, but like I told you, your ministry is so powerful because I had no idea that you brought so many. Uh, listening to you speak in person and about Divine Mercy was powerful. But uh, to see all of the different things that you brought, uh, the books, the pictures, the candles, the prayer cards, as you know, I walked out with a whole handful. Um, that's amazing. And, um, and like Victoria said, to go out and to meet the people in person, uh, that's what's so powerful. We need to get that message out more. And I agree with Victoria in the sense, it makes me sad the number of people who do not know about Divine Mercy Sunday, uh, who do not know about adoration, who do not know about um, all of the, the um, apparitions of our blessed mother. Um, how sad is that? And so I'm grateful to you, Dave and Joan, that you're going out and meeting the people in the churches. Uh, you mentioned you do that deliberately instead of at conferences. I looked at going to some of these conferences, even to the uh, Eucharistic adoration. 
those are really expensive, let alone paying for a hotel room and the travel costs. So God bless you, seriously, for going out and meeting people free of charge at the churches. This is very, so I can't thank you enough. You're very much appreciated. So thank you. It's, it's, it's wonderful. Uh, you're welcome. Oh, we oh my it. God. <laughs> is that the, is that, can you see that? Yeah. That's yesterday with Fawn at her parish. It was, it's a great. It was trip. awesome. Yes. It just, a, it was beautiful parish visit and uh, Mary Kay, you know, meeting you in person. Wow. It's just, you know. They had about, I don't know, 60, 70 people in the afternoon for the holy hour. We had a holy hour. We gave a little talk and prayed the chaplet and did the novena. They have a they have about 60 people that belong to their Eucharistic Apostles of, of Divine Mercy. You know, that's our sister ministry uh, that they've had for like three years now, I think. So um, 60 of them. It's a, a good group. Everyone. Man, it's, I, you know, I can't recall uh, such an impressive Eucharistic Apostles. And then there were groups parish. that came from other parishes, surrounding parishes. You know, we even had some people that came down from Oklahoma that that say they get our emails and yes. they take part in the novena. They said they're just a little shy for coming on Zoom, but I encourage them. Maybe we'll see them. <laughs> so were they the ones that were responsible for bringing you there? That group, uh, uh, the, what did you call them? The Eucharistic um... Apostles of the Divine Mercy. Yeah, it's a cynical. Yeah, their leader, um, Ofer, he had he tried last year, but it it the parish, it, it just didn't work out. And so we didn't think they were going to get to go this year. But then kind of like the last minute, it, it did. And uh, well, I say the last minute, it was early Lent. We didn't think it was going to happen. And But he he pushed, he pushed. And uh, mm -hmm. so we have yeah well and, and good for them and um uh, and so the, obviously they're very active because I went uh earlier I, I forget when it was but they brought Chris to um uh, also uh with the help of Fawn because Fawn mentioned that at the um social hour and that's uh, so I I was fortunate enough to go to that one as well so I mean I think. Uh, people, the 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 parishioners are thirsty for this. They they want to hear more, and I think that's why Father Chris Aylar is so uh, popular. Why Father Mike Schmidt is so popular because people want to hear more of this. They want the truth, and um, and Jonah and Dave, you're right up there with them. And you are. Yeah, it's you guys are boots on the ground. We need more. We that's part of the mission of Christ is getting it out there and talking to people, spreading that good word. Um, I, I mentioned this to you in our conversation, Jonah, on the phone. People just don't realize uh, what's in our in our arsenal as Catholics. It's such a beautiful beautiful thing to get you closer to blessed mother to christ himself they don't they, there is a, a a mass confusion you know our prayer is needed there there has been a distortion um but it's easily corrected through simple conversation and really getting in front of it and telling people what it's really all about you know and especially our young people who haven't had the exposure to it or or people like me RCIA Catholics who I've learned what I've learned from my mom but she's you know she was pre she was Baltimore catechism pre Vatican council changeover so some things have even changed for her and she would go to mass when it was all in latin so <laughs> and the whole setup was very different but still in all she knows about these these gifts of mercy that are set upon us through prayers and you know that's what the devil wants he doesn't want us praying he doesn't want us praying for each other let alone the problems of the world he doesn't want that it's it means his destruction 
That's part of the message. We have to be warriors in this too. We cannot be passive about it. Um, prayer is powerful. It's meaningful. Um, prayer in community is that much stronger. So, you know, what you are doing and as a couple, what an example. As a married couple, the example that you give, you are a living example of Christ. Your marriage is not in two, but three. Christ is at the center of it. You see it in you see it in the way that you interact with each other, how you speak, how it's beautiful. It's really beautiful and it's inspiring. And that's that's a message that is universal it it hits home to so many people i i will pray for you more 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 of it more of it if we can get you into new jersey let's do it we appreciate let's do it that. we've done it we've yeah we spent a yeah. lot of time in new jersey but i i tell you what you know our goal is has been yeah we can come in and speak but that's why we uh like um Mary Kay said we had a big, we bring a big huge book table and I, I said well when people come and they're hungry and they want more and not just for themselves you know to dive deeper but to be able to share it with others and I just real quick you know yesterday one of the things that happened we we had noon mass and um we had set up our table beforehand and then afterwards in the back I was thinking uh, when I was packing up, I asked Fawn, I said, should I bring some Spanish stuff? She goes, well, I don't know, maybe a little bit, but I thought, you know what? We have it. I'm bringing it. Cause just, if I don't, someone's going to ask me right now <laughs> after mass, there was this woman holding a baby with two little boys and a, like a 13 year old girl, beautiful family, beautiful family. She said, Oh, I don't go to this parish. I go to another one, but today we came here for mass and we saw the divine mercy at the back. I didn't know you were going to be here do you have anything in Spanish? Yes, come over here. But the point was, she said at the next door parish, their Spanish community is busy on taking the images of the divine mercy around to different families. And she said, yes. and we're going into homes where they're amazed that people don't know their faith. They don't know about Jesus. They don't know about the blessed mother. They don't know their prayers. And she said, in the miraculous things, one family, I told this yesterday, it was praying their daughter was missing, but oh my God, they, she turned up found, you know, and I said, well, they need to do the enthronement, not just bring Jesus in. She goes, well, what is that? So shared the enthronement package. And now, because we went there to the trenches now, even, even like Fawn's cynical and the other cynicals that were there from the other churches, like we can do this. We can now go to people's homes and help them sanctify the grounds, consecrate their families, and throne Jesus. So that's where we're like, you know, that's what makes us happy now that we know that we've just gone and given some people some good ideas, hopefully, not our ideas, the things that the Lord has said to do, and that wonderful people now are, are willing to go out and, like you said, you know, live it, spread it, spread it to others. So it's, we're, we're all working hand in hand, and um, so we're, we're just appreciative of everything that you're doing. We're going to keep your retreat, uh, in our prayers as we can pray for our ladies. Yes. Thank you. Uh, this novena this week. And we'd love to have you back whenever you can fit us into your schedule, uh, to share with us what, what you're doing and your inspiring words. Um, Amen. and so I will just quickly let, let's we're gonna we have to kind of cut it early today but does anybody else have a, a question or a comment okay evan actually i do have something to share um i was in a competition with my high school friends uh i was in agua and we were in this competition um all different district uh schools came so, so we actually won. Yay. That's awesome. Yes. Wonderful. Yeah. We won, we won, we, um, Chippewa High School won, we won our, we won our reward. 
That's awesome. Of the best choir ever. <laughs> so, I, mean, I knew you were yeah. waiting. <laughs> Joan, uh, it's Wheezy. I have a question, Victoria. Yes. Um, I'm in Cherry Hill, New Jersey. Oh, hello, do Cherry you, Hill. Do you, how far I my my uh girlfriend, her daughter went to co her college was in um where you live, Hoboken. How do you say it? Hoboken. Hoboken. Hob Hoboken. Yeah. Maybe she went to Stevens, the Stevens uh, Technologi Technology School. How how far are you from, are you north or are you north. like? North. You're north. Okay. So then Pennsylvania is, that's further than where I'm at. You're north? Yeah. You know, like so, the Ben Franklin Bridge? Did you ever hear of the yes. Ben Franklin? Yes. All right. Did you? I'm near there, Ben Franklin Bridge and Walt Whitman okay. Bridge. So, so just should... remind me again, what's the what is the county that Camden that Cherry Hill County. Is in? Camden County. Okay. So you're probably not far from, from Philadelphia. No, 20 minutes to the bridge. <laughs> but I don't I don't do bridges. <laughs> no, I do them, but I'm paralyzed. Right. I have a lot of um issues i couldn't you know i can't be too far from my home yeah least, understood yeah well i'll have to go down there and visit you bring lunch yeah, that's to you it. just there Call it is Johnny and we'll do a three-way on the phone and yeah yeah oh that'd be wonderful okay i'm yeah because th that's where i am cherry hill new jersey now my parish holy eucharist nothing Oh. nothing well, so we're gonna pray this gonna pray. Weekend. yeah you know for yeah churches to come on to come on fire wheezy yeah it's so yeah amen. i was looking around you know here's saint francis you know across, here's manhattan central park donna paulucci uh if i'm not mistaken it's up here in the bronx there's the bronx right and uh i was thinking we were in uh a parish in new jersey that was uh, not far from the Statue of Liberty, and I did find it. It was in Bayonne. Saint oh, which one? St. Henry's, or was it? Beautiful Saint church. St. Henry. Henry, yes. Oh, yes, that's a beautiful church. So oh, wow. yeah. While I was poking around looking for this, look what I came across. Oh, yes, I saw that on the news. I've seen that image, yes. On yes. April 3rd, did that, did that happen yesterday? Yes, it did. Wow. Very bad storms here yesterday. Oh, yeah. yeah and here, too. This was saying yesterday when we were praying. Was that yesterday? Yeah, I that thought was. It was... Mm -hmm. Yes, it was. I, I, I saw it on the news. Yeah. Wow. Oh. That is not a good sign. Anyway. Does that happen often? No. Mm. No. Well, it's so. kind of interesting as some of the things that uh, we were just really proclaimed this last weekend on Easter. So. Well, that's why we're meeting here. That's, that's why we're why. Yep. <laughs> we are here as a uh, victory. We're generating God's love and mercy. Yeah. Great, great prayer warriors here. So tomorrow, like I mentioned, it's a big day. We'll be praying for the holy souls in purgatory. Oh, and the, the greatest yeah. work of mercy. What? Mm -hmm. I now asked, are we live on YouTube? And I'm I'm having trouble uh getting the the getting that all arranged so no we are not live on youtube maybe i can work on that this evening and we'll just we'll just see it's it hasn't i don't know why it's it it you know it would let let us do it sometimes and then not others and the last mm. four or five times i've tried it it said no so you i'm working on it you need to yeah. pray harder yeah pray for dave yeah. pray for youtube <laughs> but you'll be able to upload it later yes that's yes. typically how they do it Will be uploaded tonight. We'll yeah, get it this uploaded in a couple hours. All right, Victoria, you're from here. Your... Who is that? Did someone say something? I'm sorry. No, I think it. I was just. I think we're good. All right. Okay. Well, with that, everybody, wow, Victoria, we love you. Thank uh, you so uh, join much. us whenever you can. Yeah.
And uh, we love every single one of you. Thank you all uh, for joining us, for continuing with your prayers. Keep spreading the word about the Feast of Mercy. I've got some great comments. I will. Yeah. Let's have great expectations and uh, great trust in the love, the mercy, the power of our God, his mother, all the angels and saints that are are rejoicing with us this Easter season. So, mm -hmm. gosh, best to all of you. That means kisses and hugs and we will see you tomorrow with our guest kevin mccarthy yes <laughs> yay not, speaker, not the speaker the <laughs> former speaker the theologian the theologian yeah. mm -hmm. i'll be watching All right. have a good night everyone God bless you oh, thank, thank you, you. Good good bless. Night.